when your company actually take a btp productive account when your company actually buy btp what are the options what are the subscription model you can choose from so there are two types of commercial plans the first plan is called consumption based plan second is called subscription based plan yes sub subscription and consumption consumption is how much you consume like your data plan of mobile phone yes so when you buy a recharge on a prepaid mobile in your company you will choose 4 gb 8 gb 10 gb plan right so 4 gb per month is free right 5g 5g internet of 4 gb is free in that plan right if you take higher pay money you pay higher money 8 gb 10 gb plan like that so that's called consumption based model how much you consume that much your bill then next is subscription based model so here you don't know how much is your consumption you you want to go free float so in that case more you uh, more you want to go with a fixed fixed plan right so you say you already know that you want to go with 10 gb plan because 10 gb suffice for you you go with subscription based plan but if you are not sure you don't want to upper cap you want to say okay i am i am a rich people i i can use 10 gb 20 gb my my uses are not fixed then i can go consumption based plan that how much i consume that much you charge me yeah don't fix it for me don't fix it for me so that you can actually do so depending on your requirement you can choose a particular plan actually you can choose a particular plan so a subscription based plan yeah, is a plan where you will just subscribe to these services there is a fixed commitment it's a la carte you pay upfront only for services that you plan to use at a fixed cost irrespective of consumption so this is a plan where you don't be you will your bill will not exceed a certain amount you'll say this these are the services exactly i want to use it is very suitable for customers who have very well defined use cases that okay i want to use this sap btp platform for process automation only yes and this much is my consumption so if you have a pre well defined use cases in advance and you are very sure what you want to use btp for you go with subscription based plan whereas there is a fixed commitment there is a fixed cost it is irrespective of whether your uses are high or low that much money you need to pay every month that's a subscription based plan like your mobile recharge 4 gb 8 gb 20 gb fix you fix it 20 gb is my charge okay this is the cost done yes beyond that you can't you can't use yes if you want to use more you have to recharge again now then comes this consumption based plan consumption based plan commercial model is then available in three more models the first two models are called btp ea and cpea cloud platform enterprise agreement and btp enterprise agreement plan they both are more or less same the btp ea is latest cp ea is old in btp btp ea you will have access to latest services also but in cp ea you will not have access to very latest service so if you are going with build process automation and build apps my recommendation for you to go with btp ea plan for your company now in this case you have a commitment to consume so you will say to sap at least this much i need yeah upfront commitment is there so you have to fix it you have to say at least i will use this much yeah so for that let's say you decided one thousand dollar per month so twelve thousand dollar yearly commitment you have to put upfront with sap whether you use it or not use it that much is your upfront bill like a postpaid mobile plan where you you choose postpaid mobile plan 300 rupees bill will come 100 percent for you every month whether you use your phone or not use your phone you are taking postpaid plan yeah 300 rupees then on top whatever you use how much ever you use that much will be your bill so more you use more your bill less you use that's a fixed cap so in that fixed cap you get some free services those key you can use it for free but beyond the certain amount your bill will increase they will be billed monthly so every month you will be charged by sap so every month there will be a charge by sap they will charge you every month yeah, monthly bill will come so it is based on consumption and there is an upfront commitment then there's another plan called pay as you go plan this is also known as free tier so somebody was asking me anubhav can you tell me what is free tier plan this is free tier plan also called as free tier in this there is no upfront commitment 
zero commitment this is suitable for customer who don't have well defined use case who want to use and try btp they want to hit and run they want to see okay everybody is yelling btp 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 i want to use a btp productive account for some days and see how does it go well i want to try out some poc yes so here they will ask you to create give your credit card details your pay as you go plan so here you pay with no commitment at the beginning but the moment you start consuming paid services they will start charging you based on consumption the difference here is there is no upfront commitment but there are no discounts also in btp ea plan you will get discounted rates on services but in pay as you go plan since you are not giving any commitment upfront there are no discounts so rate wise there will be higher rate on this because there is no upfront commitment so these are the plans you can choose from yes these are the btp subscription model it's a very important interview question so in interview you can say there are two broader type of plan subscription based plan and consumption based plan in the consumption based plan we have the btp ea and cpea and pay as you go plan so depending on the upfront commitment and well defined use cases you can choose again i will put a link here in the description you can see here the link which also explains it well in detail it takes you to sap official documentation for uh, btp subscription commercial models and here you can read more about these subscription plan in detail so that is how your sap btp commercial model work based on subscription based plan and the consumption based plan so you can decide which one you want to go so then based on these plans you can check the cost of each of the service so what you do is now you go to sap btp service discovery center provided by sap yes and i can see the cost so suppose my manager ask me how much the btp uh, build process automation service is going to cost me please tell me per month yes so depending on my service plan it will be so i come there to this link sap btp service discovery center and i search for sap build enter and you see there are a lot of them so i go with build process automation service i go inside i go to pricing and i will choose my model which subscription model i have taken from sap suppose i have taken btp ea plan in btp ea plan you see btp enterprise agreement plan it's a consumption based model so if you come down you can see technical feature how many jobs you can run what is the quota per tenant what is the block size and what what are the data centers what are the providers infrastructure provider and what are the data center this service is available which i can use yes and then if you come down you see how much is going to be the cost so you see free if it's a free uses there are certain limit of free uses yes that's a free uses limit in this this particular plan because you've done upfront commitment so they give you certain amount of free uses but if your uses exceed how much you going to cost so if your uses exceeds 1000 per api call per month with 100 mb of global storage then you are you can see up to 500 this is the cost per month cost it is yeah you see up to 1000 calls 1.61 euro per month yes that's the cost so you can see here for different different plans and what is the cost of each of the service so that is how you are going to help or you are going to tell your business your managers your company that this particular btp service if i want to use and this is our model which we have taken that is the cost it is going to incur above the free uses so you can also add it to a estimator tool and calculate the overall cost for different different services in btp so that's how as a consultant as a btp administrator or as a btp consultant you can always go back and check the different commercial model which your company have taken number 1 number 2 how much is the free uses they allow number 3 what is the cost so if i have taken for example pay as you go plan which is also known as free tier free tier you see how much is the free allowed in free tier and beyond that limit how much is going to be cost so you can see rates are little higher here because there is no upfront commitment hence you are not getting discounted rates as i explained already so that is how exactly as a consultant you can help your company your manager your team to decide which commercial model to choose from for btp and which is the what is the cost of the service yes so that's that is how you can always decide the same 
so uh, this is called btp commercial uh, models and this is how you can see always the each of the particular service which your company is planning to use and how much cost it is going to incur for your company perfect so that comes to the end of this session today i hope you enjoyed this session on understanding the btp commercial models and understanding backing services subscriptions and instance based services and how the cost will be decided for your different different services which you use in your btp account with that thank you so much once again for joining this session and i hope to see you in my next episode tomorrow till then happy coding and goodbye